So we took a little road trip. We're out here on the river today. Different setting than usual. Um, we're looking for some fall steelheads. Not something we do a whole lot of, but uh, this should be a good trip. We're gonna see. Looks like the reports have been pretty good for where we are right now. We're kind of doing this back and forth game. It's a small system, so someone kind of sits in the boat, go to the next spot, let someone fish that head. Uh, nervous water, whatever it might be, and then we kind of switch back and forth. And there's a few few runs down low that ha we'll have a chance for both of us to get in there and fish. But oh, I'm on, dude. Got the new drift dry bag. This thing, this thing is sweet. Fits all my stuff. I actually have a link in the description of these guys. It's a lo local company. Um, I'm gonna give them a try. Highly recommend it. The waders are awesome. The bag's awesome. Cool. Well, that's playing pretty good. Probably have to walk the boat through this next series of rapids. Pretty much every rapid on this river today is it's going to be a potential walker. Yeah, buddy. It's October, dude. This is kind of cool to be steelheading. Yeah, it is October. Last year we didn't really fish all that much in October, so it's going to be fun. Here's your dude wipes. I haven't played this in a long time. It's a desperate day, dude. Szechuan chili is not good. Okay. You ate some bad Szechuan chili oil? Seen a couple steelhead, blew actually over a tail out. We knew there would be a fish in, but some reason we got caught floating down looking at each other, you know, saying, oh, let's push past it. And fish was sitting right there. So that, that was an L to start the day, but we'll see what we can do getting into it. This feels pretty good in the current. All things considered, <laughs> when you're craving a little tug, that's not a bad feeling. Oh, you hit it with the current too, huh? Yeah, you hit it pretty good. Wild. <laughs> not a hatchery fish. <laughs> so. Nice. Took that thing like a son of a gun. <laughs> For a second there, I was like, "What is this? That's yeah. not trout. That's it's a little like, it's too pretty, big. Yeah, it's pulling pretty good. The traditional hair wing thing. Yeah, that's pretty cool. You want to go stealth mode. So I'm not in the water waiting. I'm actually on the bank fishing, like if I was fishing the gear rod. I'm using a commando head. This is a seven weight renegade. I mean, it's kind of built for situations like this. Smaller water." fish can't go on big runs so really I'm kind of just switch casting I'm just getting my line close to me and rolling it back out I'm wearing drab colors see on some of the drone footage of me I basically look like the background just gray and brown I'm not wearing any high vis my bags back in the boat I'm using a really natural fly with a longer leader don't need to go down in the size of the line. I'm still using 12 pound test right now. I think any fish that's gonna chase a swung fly and eat it, don't necessarily care if you're using 12 pound or four pound test, you're just gonna lose the fish on one or the other. <laughs> and really, I just put more weight on the fly and lengthen the leader so that the fly itself is dropping down more naturally. And as soon as it touches down, it's not getting dragged, it has some time to fall. 
It's almost like a single spay, but not really. It's like a half a peri poke. Come up and instead of throwing it back down in the water, I just go forward because I have three strips of line out. It doesn't really take much to turn this over. And I'm trying to reduce the amount of impact I'm having on the water, right? So I'm not ripping up an anchor, not doing any of that. Just kind of placing it there and going. Kind of touch and go with a little bit more of a pause. It's like a hybrid between a single spay and a peri poke. There's just no poke. But there's also, and I'm not going as soon as it touches down. I'm coming over, touching down gently, and I'm touching that far bank. And that's another thing is when the water is this small and you can fish the whole river, happily do so, right? They'll sit tucked on so either side. I know that side's deep and rocky. I'm gonna try and get my fly with weight to drop as close as I can to those, that structure on that far side. You'll actually eat it on the fall sometimes. So just see the, the line will land and then the line will go tight right away. Like that call it's been uh trout have hit it so far today yeah i don't think there's any reason steel wouldn't come and snack on that steel would smash that dude i think they're already snacking on it fish in front of me dude let's fish this with some integrity so i just had an interaction with the first steelhead of the day in this tiny little piece of side current on the side of this island here wasn't recording, but this is thin 18 inch water. It's aerated, w water's low. You know, we're doing the opposite. We're not going to the big deep holes. We're going to the aerated stuff. That's cool, man. A fall, a fall Chinook snagged. It wasn't a Chinook. You jordy him, dude. It was not snagged. The way he was bucking. <laughs> well, you're not gonna like this. Telltale sign of a snag. Yeah. <laughs> so you lost your fly due to what? I was stuck in a tree. I was trying to replicate what you did this morning, which is, you know, we're fishing things that are a little buggier. Yeah. Like do the hit the tree, fall out of the tree. It's a real natural presentation. And the scent of that, like. That tree, the smell of the alder will stay on the fly. Yeehaw! Content we were just a little nervous. It gets right. He's got my bane, we're in the game. Let's fish this. Yeah, and then we'll and then back let's, up. Let's go back up. Yeah, yeah, if they don't like the big, give them the small. Huh? I mean, those fish are sweet too, man. Yeah, dude, nice move. It's been an incredible day. We haven't touched base with the people. No, we haven't touched base with the people. We went on one run, basically two continuous runs, and touched in that time four fish. Steelhead. Steelhead. Yeah, it was crazy. It's blowing our minds. So it's raining. We haven't had the camera out. Keeping not, the yeah. not lying. <laughs> not lying. But yeah, the rain is thrown a little bit. We focused in on fishing, and we've missed a lot. But part of it, we say the tugs the drugs. So today is. Freaking cool. Yeah, dude. Let's go another one. Go ahead and redeem yourself. We're at another shoot. I figured I'd record this time based on what happened last. Looks promising down there. I always like to fish a run as if I'm being judged by Gordon Ramsay. Okay, Sean. God damn it. We suck, dude. We missed them all. Oh, it was like oh for four. On 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 on. Miss 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 miss. Oh for four does bite. Yeah. Off. <laughs> yeah, that was a steelhead. Dude, I don't understand. I don't understand, dude. I can't believe that, dude. That many M's in the bank. <laughs> boat. Get in the boat. No, I just ha I felt the takes and the head shakes and then it started running. Did it run? 
This reel's silent. No, it was like right on the far side. I just did. Yeah. It's like right when it started to swing. That hurt bad. That was only my fourth miss because you, you caught the other fish. I was like, wait, five? There's no way I missed five. Oh, it came out. Yeah. Dude, I was just getting in position. Oh. Oh. Dude. Oh. I think you got to give up the front, man. Holy shit, dude. I wonder if that was almost a situation where I needed to stop with the down and dirty because there was so much pressure on the yeah. line from the current and he was just holding in that heavy rift. Yeah. I probably needed to come up and get him to push upstream because there was a lot of torque. Oh, my God. That's fine. That's fine. All right, I just walked back up to the top where I had my, lost my last fish. This is gonna be the last spot of the day for me. I'd like to apologize in advance for all the chest POV footage today. It's raining like this. We don't usually bring the big camera out. Okay, I just had a rip. suspicious rippage.